Hello YouTube. Well, it's August the 4th, 2015, and this is day one of my indoor gardening journey. I purchased these two aerial garden units from my local Walmart store, and I've set them up, and I'm looking forward to having some very nice spices, such as dill, basil, and parsley, and I also have some tomatoes here. It's my desire to be able to grow because my grandmother was an excellent gardener and she had a very large backyard, but in my place it's very small and I don't have the ability to do any gardening outdoors. So in my small apartment, I am going to be setting out on this indoor gardening journey and I'd like you to get involved with it because I think this is very doable, very sustainable, and it's something that everybody in your life can enjoy. Also, it's something that will last for a long time. Uh, right here in this unit, I have, if you can see this, I have some tomato plants. And um, they haven't sprouted yet, but I can see that it's going to. The little baby sprout is down in there, and it'll probably take about a week to pop up. So I'll be um, following all the manufacturer's directions to make sure the nutrient balance is good and that I top off the water every two weeks and keep fresh nutrients in it for the tomato plants to grow. I have a lot of recipes that I'll be sharing with you for the tomatoes that come uh, from these two plants. Then I'm going to kind of mosey on over here and this is the spice garden and we have some dill we have basil and we have small leaf parsley and I set these to run like day and night um, so it's 16 hours of daylight and then eight hours of nighttime so it'll be on the same schedule when I go to sleep and I will definitely keep you updated on the progress of my indoor garden. This is a hydroponic garden, but it doesn't utilize goldfish, so no goldfish involved. It's just uh, nutrient enriched water. And um, I hope that you will follow along and uh, we'll be able to get a lot of great recipes from the tomatoes and the spices. And I hope to continue to be able to uh, even get some more of these, the very, very large side, size, and grow lettuce and salad greens and cucumbers. And I'm really looking forward to being able to, uh, to expand on this idea. Please follow my channel with my new indoor gardening. And uh, you can also make suggestions of recipes as we go along with this. And I hope that I'll get a lot of new fans that's interested in uh, sustainable indoor gardening.